Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video, we have got these uh, bunch of uh, rectangles uh, put together as you can see in this uh, diagram such that the area of this uh, yellow rectangle is 96 uh, centimeter square. The area of this uh, blue rectangle is 36 uh, centimeter square. The area of this uh, green uh, rectangle is uh, 48 centimeter square. And finally, the area for this uh, purple uh, rectangle is uh, 80 centimeter square and moreover this lower horizontal uh, distance is uh, 10 centimeter and just keep in your mind that none of these uh, given uh, boxes is a square and now our task is to calculate this uh, horizontal distance uh, x please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe let me make it very clear that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's our very first step. Let's focus uh, on these uh, boxes, uh, green and purple combined. Let's assume that this uh, horizontal uh, distance is uh, A and we know that this whole horizontal distance is 10. So therefore, uh, this uh, distance uh, has got to be 10 minus uh, a. And now let's recall a crucial uh, fact. We have got uh, these uh, two rectangles uh, such that the area of this uh, yellow rectangle is A and the area for this uh, blue rectangle is B with their respective side lengths A and B as you can see over here. We can see both of these uh, rectangles have the same uh, height then we can write uh, the ratio of their areas is equal to the ratio of their uh, side lengths. So we are going to apply this uh, concept uh, over here in our case. And here we can see both of these rectangles have the same height. Therefore, we can write the ratio of their areas. Let me write down 80 divided by 40 8 is going to be their respective distance is going to be 10 minus a and a let me go ahead and write down the ratio of 10 minus a divided by a and now we can see on the left hand side this fraction can be reduced to 5 divided by 3 since we're going to divide both sides by 16 that's going to give us 5 divided by 3. So therefore, I can write 5 divided by 3 equals to 10 minus a all over a. Now let's go ahead and cross uh, multiply. So that is going to give us 5 times a equals to, if we multiply these together, let's go ahead and multiply, distribute 30 minus uh, 3a. Now let's go ahead and add 3a on both sides. This is gone. On the left hand side we got 8a equals to 30. Now let's divide both sides by 8 and this 8 and 8 is gone. So therefore a is equal to if we reduce this thing that is going to give us 15 divided by 4 centimeter. So thus our this distance a turns out to be 15 divided by 4 centimeter. And now let's focus on this uh, blue rectangle. We know that uh, this uh, side length uh, is going to be same as this one which is uh, 15 divided by 4 centimeter. And let's assume the side length of this uh, blue rectangle this side uh, is lowercase b and we know the area of this uh, blue rectangle is uh, 36 centimeter square and now let's recall the area of a rectangle formula area equals to length times width in our case the area of this uh, blue rectangle is 36 and its side lengths are 15 divided by 4 and b so let's go ahead and fill in the blanks so this is going to give us uh, 36 uh, equals to 15 divided by 4 times b 
And now let's go ahead and remove this uh, fraction by multiplying its reciprocal. 4 divided by 15 on this side and 4 divided by 15 on the left hand side as well. And we can see on the right hand side 15 and 15 is gone, 4 and 4 is gone. And this on the left hand side if we reduce this thing that is going to give us 48 divided by 5. So therefore our B value turns out to be 48 divided by 5 centimeter. So therefore our this side length B turns out to be 48 divided by 5 centimeter. And here's our next step. Let's focus on these two rectangles. These are yellow and blue combined. The total area of these two rectangles is going to be 96 plus 36. That is going to give us 132 centimeters square and now we can see the combined area for these both rectangle is 132 centimeters square its side lengths are x and 48 divided by 5 and now let's recall the area of rectangle formula once again a equals to length times width let's go ahead and fill in the blank so we have 132 equals to 40 8 divided by 5 times x and now we are going to solve for x before we do that one let me go ahead and multiply both sides by its reciprocal 5 divided by 48 on the right hand side and likewise 5 divided by 48 on the left hand side as well and now we can see this 48 and 48 is gone this 5 and uh, 5 is gone so if we simplify the left hand side that is going to give us 55 divided by 4 so thus our x value turns out to be 55 divided by 4 centimeter and that could also be written as in terms of decimal that is going to be 13.75 centimeter so thus we conclude that our x value turns out to be equal to 55 divided by 4 centimeter or simply in terms of decimal this is equal to 13.75 centimeter so thus our final answer x turns out to be equal to 13.75 centimeter Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.